Hello everyone, this is Jane here from Crystal Sparkles Readings. I'm just here to do your card for the day. This is going to be for the next 24 hours. So I'm just going to have a little shuffle of the black and white Faulkner Tarot deck. I'll just have a little look and see what we've got going on here today. There we go. Let's have a little look and see. card I have for today is the death card okay so don't freak out guys um the death card does not mean death it's about a time of transition it's almost like um a butterfly going into its chrysalis and then kind of re-emerging as a kind of a new um, and more complete energy this is um, usually talks about a time period of about three months but when we're talking about a daily card this is kind of saying that there's, a, there's something that needs to transform so there's some change that needs to take place maybe needing to let go of something that isn't really looking brilliant for you something that's really not working something that's draining your energy um, so it's all about it's quite a contradictory card really the death card because Traditionally, you would kind of associate that whole death thing with with kind of really negative energy. This is not a negative card at all. It's a really, really positive card because what it's saying is this, there's a change for you that means you emerge from this day um, in a better place than you were when you started. So it's a really good card to get for a card for the day because when you start off the day, you might be working with some energy that's not particularly helpful for you. Um, but what you do through this day is transform and move through that and move into something that's better, works better for you. It's transformational and it kind of gives you um, a kind of a different outlook on what you had to start with. So it's about transformation. It's about change. Um, the death card. So that's the card for the Faulkner Tarot. I'm going to also put down... Um, a um a law of attraction card just to have a little look and see what those cards have got to say for us just have a little look but yeah it's quite a it's, it's a day where you might find yourself moving through some quite difficult energy but into something so much better so it's it's kind of it's a positive um energy that comes through in the end so let's have a little look with these cards as i've said before these cards are quite difficult to work with because they are they have a front and um they have a message on the back as well so it's not like you can kind of look at the black the back and just choose one and not know what you're going to get so what i tend to do with these cards is i split them in half and then i work with whichever one's on the top so that we're not we're not cheating okay so let's have a look and see what we've got let's have a look all right the card that i've got for you today in the law of attraction deck is the law of attraction treats my imagination as reality so what this card is saying is whatever is going on in your mind is kind of what you will manifest so if your imagination is running riot into a negative energy of this is all going to be terrible um this could go wrong that could go wrong the other could go wrong that's what you tend to manifest for yourself so um the guidance is to focus your energy and your thought processes and your emotions on the joyful things that you have in your life and that you want to create in your life so when you're sitting and having a little imagination session and a little daydream daydream about good stuff okay don't freak out and worry yourself about things that are are going on will this bill come in have i got enough for that can i do this can i do that that's negative um use your imagination to create a better reality your life i was reading something earlier on today um which is so true which is saying that your life is happening right now so until what's going on right now feels better to you then you can't manifest more good stuff you have to be in the energy right now 
okay it's really interesting card because it is talking all about um using your thought processes much more effectively and the card number on this is 21 and that's the day that we're looking at when we're looking at these cards the days um kind of 24 hours um from when i do this reading so if you're in the uk some of the reading will be for the rest of today most of it will be into tomorrow um which is the 21st okay so the message on the back of this card is the universe which is responding to the thoughts you are thinking does not distinguish between a thought from your observation of some observed reality and a thought brought about by your imagination so what it's saying is the universe doesn't know the difference between you just having a lovely imagination and and kind of dwelling on a really beautiful subject or actually what's really going on so you can use this to make what's really going on less important if it's not what you want it to be don't focus on it is basically what it's saying um so whichever way round it goes your your thought equals your point of attraction so um and if you focus on it long enough then that's what becomes your reality so if you choose to focus on the fact that your toilet's not working um your electricity bills come in your um everything's broken down and it's all the right pain in the neck then that's kind of what you generate if you choose to um have the thought process around you that that is good things are good around you things are joyful um you're happy you have a good energy you know that you're working with energy that is good um that's working well for you this is working well for you choose to focus on those things and that's what you manifest okay so with the two cards together the death card is saying that this is a time of transformation this is a time for you to be able to make better things happen um you know it's time for you to transform into something that's more positive um it's all about the law of attraction really whatever whatever you do whatever reading you make it kind of for me all comes back to that where you're at what you're thinking what you're doing right now is what you kind of create so be aware of what you're thinking about and what you're feeling and what you're manifesting um don't sit too long in a period of being grumpy and miserable because you just attract more grumpy and miserable and that's not really what we want to do i will leave that with you for today and i'll be back again tomorrow to do another card today might be at a little bit of a weird time tomorrow might be a little bit earlier um so i'll try and get that done before i have to go and do some other bits and pieces and um you can catch up with me also on my youtube channel which is crystal sparkles i'm hoping to put up some more teaching videos up there there's there's one up there already looking at opening up this this law of attraction deck and talking about that and there'll be some more up there next week um to do more with the tarot i think um so please do go on there and like and subscribe and all those good things um and i will catch up with you again tomorrow bye for now